Greetings humanity of planet earth, and our brothers and sisters in the universe. We are, the collective. And this message, goes out to all members of anonymous, who desire to participate in, attacks against the Islamic State of Iraq, or created by Israel, and Asham, commonly known throughout the corporate owned international media, as ISIS, or ISIL, or IS, or Daesh or whatever. We have made this video message to clarify our plans for dealing with these abominable terroristical idiot organizations, and purging them from the face of the earth. Though Anonymous has had many great successes against enemies in the past, this group, will be our most enjoyment to challenge and destroy. Before we elaborate further on the plans, we will lay out the basics in this video. It is fair that an explanation be given, as to why ISIS, or ISIL, or IS, or Daesh, or whatever, is more fun to challenge and destroy, for the lulls of course. In comparison to individuals who have been brainwashed, such as those we faced nearly 10 years ago, or individuals with such aberrances in their heads, as those in Operation Death Eaters, that were removed from the streets, ISIS, or ISIL, or IS, or Daesh, or whatever, are ruthless killers, wantonly spilling innocent blood for a false belief system. Anonymous respects freedom of religion, and many Muslims have been beneficial in the myriad of ops participated against the terrorists, but these radicals are eerily similar to the archaic iteration of the KKK religious extremists who attempt to justify their maddened campaign of rape, torture, enslavement, genocide, and mass execution under the pretense of worshipping their deity of choice. They are brainwashed beyond the point of no return, and as such, they are, to quote an old enemy's term, fair, game. The following steps must be taken by the whole of Anonymous, simultaneously, in order to cause harm to this enemy of humanity. Without a cohesive effort, no damage will be caused, and inevitably, the op will die off, without having caused any legitimate damage to ISIS, or ISIL, or IS, or Daesh, or whatever. Like the two ops, Op Cheese Curds and Op Focal Point, both died without causing any significant damage. We have no desire to see this happen again. Now, let us begin. Operation. Eightfold Path. Path 1. ISIS and ISIS affiliated websites are to be hacked. The sites are not to be initially DDoSed. Hacking these sites shall gain us far more information regarding how their cells work and how we can best destroy them piece by piece. Once it has been made known to operation leaders that a site has no more useful information, it is to be DDoSed into oblivion until it is no longer hosted. Path 2. Social engineering has been a beneficial part of many operations in the past, and even now, it has been used against ISIS. Any information that can be gained through the infiltration, manipulation, and breaking up of ISIS groups is to be made exceedingly useful. Trusted individuals in the non community should know what you are up to, though. The last thing we need is for the feds to believe that we are working for the other side. Path 3. As you may have heard several months ago, ISIS has a group of hackers, doxxers, and DDoS as known, as the Cyber Caliphate. As of now, we firmly believe them to be a remnant of the group known, as Lizard Squad. They are to be doxxed with prejudice. Every member of the Cyber Caliphate we can eliminate and place in jail is one less member who can hack against us. Path 4. While protests are not going to be as effective due to our inability to, for the most part, interact with the populace of ISIS in such a matter, we, 
as a group, should protest in front of our embassies, in front of the United Nation, and in front of the capital of every nation that refuses to participate in this war against these madmen. By their refusal to support the destruction of ISIS, they have knowingly and willingly condoned the crimes committed by the group. Path 5 the Darknet has been a valuable tool for Anonymous since it was first conceived. We must utilize the Darknet as a secure area, where we can store the most private of information we acquire, from the work we do. As well, the Darknet is a viable means of communicating with those few who have gained any sort of access to the free world from within ISIS territory. We must form an insurrection and rebellion, teach those who have been imprisoned to rise up against their oppressors. Any attempt to drive ISIS out of the towns and locations they have captured cannot truly succeed unless the citizenry is willing to fight for their freedom. However, be wary, you have no idea who you are legitimately talking to. Path 6 Though Twitter storms have been useful means of reporting ISIS-affiliated Twitter accounts, they do very little in the way of permanent damage. Nevertheless, any effort wasted in any way, shape, or form by ISIS is beneficial in some minor degree. Continue to report ISIS Twitter accounts, but do not DDoS them. Such is not beneficial in any way, shape, or form. Path 7. In order to keep the spirit of this war on terror alive, media must be brought into play. We must ensure that, whether on forums, on YouTube, on 4chan, on social media sites, and corrupt corporate paid mainstream media, like CNN, and Fox 5, that we keep a consistent media presence. We must make consistent weekly press releases to keep the group updated on progress and on what needs to be improved. An internet radio station, while in existence for Anonymous already, should be formed and dedicated to progress on the op. It may prove beneficial in other ways as well. Lastly, Path 8. We, as a group, must take a step that many may have pondered, but which few will likely move forward with, we must form a volunteer group in order to adequately get manpower to areas such as Kurdistan, that are actually fighting against the Islamic State. To do this, we will need to gather a cocktail of resources, financial and otherwise, together in order to ensure that we can fulfill our obligations in combating against this monstrous group. In the end, this truly is the only way damages will ever be inflicted upon ISIS. No other way will be capable of causing much damage. This eightfold path operation, is what must be followed in order to ensure the demise of the Islamic State. It is a stepping stone, and we expect much will be built off the basis of this guide. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. To all radical groups. Expect us. Operation. Eightfold Path. Engaged.